Today I'm planting out three types of alum bulbs upon the plot. Let me show you these three varieties I've gone for. This is the Ambassador, as you can see, a big purple showy flower head. The Mount Everest, a white version, and finally Mars, another purple version. Right, let me get the bulbs out for you so you can have a look at them. There we go. What do you think? Big bulbs. Well, they do produce a big plant and a big flower head as shown on the packets. Um, they look like any particular vegetable to you. Maybe an onion. Well, they are considered an ornamental onion. So that's why these bulbs are very similar looking to a, an onion set. Anyway, there we go. Pretty impressive, eh? You can plant these bulbs anytime between September and December, and as you can see, the flowering time is between May and June, and this particular one here reaches a height of 130 centimeters. When they are in full bloom, they're just a big, spectacular, showy flower. They really are lovely to see, and they are a cottage garden favorite. So if you're trying to recreate that effect in your back garden, definitely get these on your menu. This is my flower bed up here on the allotment. As you can see, I've got the remnants of some gladioli bulbs and then the dahlias which I've cut back. This is a tree lily and there we've got the lupin which is uh, starting to wither away and in about a month's time there'll be nothing left of this um, but it will come back again next year anyway I'm gonna plant those six allium bulbs in that bed there now when planting these plant them together you want to create a big showy effect in your borders in late spring early summer okay when digging the hole I'm only going to go to the depth of the blade of the spade the depth of one spit um, if you want to use the technical term but yeah that deep all right here we go There we go, little worm. Nature's plows. I think that'll do it. As with all bulbs, you've got two ends. You've got the tip and the root end. You can see the little fibrous roots here. They go down. There we go. First one done. And here I've got the two white varieties, the Mount Everest. And that's it. We'll cover them up and wait for spring. Right, I really can't wait to see those alliums in full bloom on the plot in early summer. Those big flowery heads that they produce really do attract the pollinators like the bees, which is what I'm trying to do here on the allotment site. 
If you've never grown them before, do give those alien bulbs a try. You won't be disappointed. Like I said, they do put on a spectacular show in early summer. Anyway, I think that's about it for this particular video. Thank you for joining me. If you have, remember to hit that like button, share, please do subscribe to the channel, but most importantly, do comment down below. And until the next video, bye for now.